welcome. So today I'm gonna be doing an unboxing from Diamond Art Club. This kit is called The Wicked Witch. She is a round kit, and she is also 51 centimeters by 71 centimeters, or 20 inches by 28 inches. So we'll go ahead and go over the box a little bit before we get into the canvas. I'll pull you guys out a little bit. So the box looks like this. Usually when it's pink right here, it indicates that it's a round kit. Uh, square kits usually are all blue right here and would have a square right here. So we have the company logo right here, what kit it is as of square or diamonds, and then the picture of actually what's in the kit. On this side right here, it says scan me to unlock 10%. All boxes come with this on them. You can scan this code right here, our QVR code, and get 10% off. So on the back of the box, we will get the instructions on how it works right here, the kit contents in a couple different languages over here. And on this side, it just shows the company logo again, and then that is the round kit. All right, let's open her up. Okay, so in these kits, you'll get a tool kit. This kit right here, has a newer tool kits in it. It has the continent, continents, contents, <laughs> sorry, and the contents of the kit on here. And since it's not a square kit, there is no tweezers in this kit. Let's set it to the side and open it up. Alrighty, so first off, I see we have a unicorn um, cover minder, but unfortunately, the magnet has come off the back. These are super easy to fix. All you need to do is flip this over right around the round right here. You can see where it was glued before. Just put some super glue on there. I've used Dollar Tree super glue and it's worked completely fine. We also have a washi tape. The newer kits are the ones that come with the washi tape and the cover reminders. I like to use this to section off my canvas as well as go along the border of the canvas where the extra glue is at so it doesn't get dirty or sticky. And with this one, we have a green pin and a green match and squishy. We also have a seven placer and a four placer. Then you get this little heart-shaped caddy that has two heart-shaped waxes in it. The wax does have a cover on it, a plastic cover, so you're going to have to move that back before you poke your pin in it to get the wax into your pin. We also get a tray. So this one happens to be the clear and the gold one. Um, recently, they have been switching out to opaque ones. I've gotten a couple of opaque ones and a couple of kits, and I actually really like them. And it also comes with this lovely stopper. So the stopper just goes, clicks right into there. And then when you're done with the drill iron in the tray and you want to empty it, you just pull the stopper right out and then you can empty the drill iron in the tray. And then of course we get our bag of baggies. For these, you can use them to kit up if you want to. Um, or when you get down the extra drills, that's why I use these for is to put my extra drills in. And I label the whatever drill number it is and put it away. Okay, let's get all this stuff out of the way and get into this box. So in the box, you'll receive a sticker that has the name of the artist, the name of the kit, the dimensions on it, and what shape it is. And these do peel off, if I could get it to peel. I've seen people put these stickers on the side of the box when they organize them. They also put them in log books, or I've also seen um, people make cover minders out of these. Whatever you want to do with the sticker is totally up to you. 
All right, now let's get into this canvas. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take the drills out in the sticker sheet. Okie dokie guys, so this sticker sheet has pre-cut stickers on it, which makes kitting up a whole lot easier. Uh, this right here is also a giant sticker, and then on this sheet we have 27 colors. That's not very many colors. And it also looks like there is no ABs in this kit, but you could do whatever you want. You could add crystals, glitter drills, ABs, rhinestones, you name it, you could do it. It's your kit. You also get the thank you pamphlet. It has QR codes so that you could get 20% off your first purchase through either the Android app or the iPhone app. Inside, it gives you what's included into your kit, tips and tricks on what to do. Also, it gives you the QR code for your face or VIP Facebook group. Also, a QR code for an instruction video to teach you how to diamond paint. And here is the bag of drills. So I normally don't read off the drill numbers because I swear I'm dyslexic and I'll read them backwards and screw that all up. I do enough of messing up as it is. Alrighty. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six bags of 310. I get this. I am so bad at getting where the glare is not on it so you guys can see the numbers. So I'm sorry. Let's see, maybe over here. Bear with me, I am still new on making videos, so I am trying to do my best I can, especially with not knowing what I'm doing. Now I see why people read it off. It's really hard to see the numbers on these bags. That scissors throw. Again, there's only 27 uh, colors in this kit, so it's not very many. I wonder if this kit's going to have quite a bit of color blocking or if it's going to be confetti. I guess we will find out together. And those are the colors. All right, guys, I'm going to pause for a minute because my battery is about to die. And then we'll get into the kit. Give me one second. All right, guys, I am back. Sorry about that. Are you guys ready to get into this canvas? All right, I'm going to try my best to get it in frame since I have a very small space I'm working with right now. And so I find something better for recording. But here we go. Oh my goodness, she is gorgeous. I absolutely love the dark art, and I also like colorful things. I bounce between dark, fun, funky, colorful. That's just me. All right, yeah, let's see. I'm gonna turn her sideways really quickly because I can get her in frame that way so you can see her but a little bit better. Actually, so if you want to have your canvas lay a little bit better, a little bit faster, what you can do is roll it the opposite direction and it will help it lay flat. Um, Diamond Art Club does have self flattening canvases, so it will flatten out, but this is just a better way not better, but faster way to get her flat or flatter. So you will see wrinkles on the plastic cover sheet. That is just because it has shifted during transit. It is not 
anything wrong with the glue or anything. It is a poured glue canvas. So it seems to me like she has color blocking and confetti. So what confetti means, like say in this area right here, you're going to have to change out the drill color in your tray more often. Rather than when you're doing color blocking, say if right here is a big chunk of color blocking, um, you won't have to change out the color as often. She is absolutely gorgeous. So on this canvas, you will get Diamond Art Clubs. Makes you, do what makes you sparkle at the top. You also get a legend on this side and a legend down on this side. Right here on the canvas is your warranty information. And also right here is Facebook and Instagram for Diamond Art Club's information right here. And on this corner of the canvas, you will get the picture of the kit, the name of the kit, the dimensions of the kit, as well as the artist of the kit. Let's turn it this way a little bit. So I'm actually going to scoot you guys in a little bit so we can take a little bit better look at this. Oh, she's gorgeous. Yeah, so we got quite a bit of confetti right here. And like I said, color blocking up here. We got quite a bit of color blocking right here. I absolutely love the mushrooms on her hat and the city that's back here. I think what I'm going to do with the city is I might add crystals like a... Not a green, maybe like a turquoise crystal back there and make that city really pop. But all Diamond Art Club canvases are super soft on the back. They, I do believe, have upgraded their canvases to even more softer material. And I'll pull you guys back out in a little bit again so you can get a full look at her again. Sorry that she's sideways. At least I could get her in view this way. Let me guys know what you guys think of this and let me know um what other kind of videos would you guys like me to do i am a crafter and i jumped from different crafts all the time such as beading making waxes doing diamond painting doing my nails um let's see i like to do dollar tree hauls too i haven't filmed them but um, dollar tree gets me in trouble a lot of times but so has Diamond Painted because I have spent a fortune on these, but no regrets. Especially with Diamond Art Club, I absolutely love their canvases. They have been the best so far. Of course, when I started out, guess where I bought my canvases? Off Amazon. <laughs> did I know about licensing? Nope, I did not. But after doing or watching YouTube videos, I quickly learned about that. And so I decided to check out some companies. And Diamond Art Club is probably one of the first companies that I checked out, fell in love, and I am a repeat customer. Um, I do believe she is not in stock at the moment, but she is not limited edition, so that means she will be restocked. Anyhow, guys, I will talk to you later. I got a couple more canvases that I'm probably going to do an unboxing. Hopefully I get better at this video recording. <laughs> the further along down the road, the more videos I make. It is kind of, I don't know how to explain it, especially when you're talking to a camera. But so I give shout out to all those creators that put out videos constantly because it's a lot of work, a lot, a lot of work. Then kudos to you. Okay, guys, I will see you guys again in another unboxing, and you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.